Mavis Jr. I'm the artistic director with Near West Theatre and I'm directing our upcoming production of Ragtime. Initially it was um, the many many people who told me that they thought it was a wonderful show and that Near West Theatre should do it someday because of its themes and its music and uh, then once I got into uh, reading the novel by E.L. Doctorow that this play was based on and realizing that this is an incredibly um, ambitious mix of fact and fiction and memory and famous historical characters with a plot that is fictional. I got more excited about it because I love that kind of theater where you're bringing all these elements together in one surface of a production. Theater, our mantra is we are not about Xeroxing some other production of the show that we're doing and we have no desire to make it like the Broadway show, have actors in it like the original actors or have a set which reminds us in any way necessarily of the original set and I'm working with an incredible team of, 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 of designers on this, on this production who have all taken that very seriously but in our production we are building three false prosceniums added into our space. We're turning part of the Victorian opera boxes that exist in the third floor of St. Pat where we got permission to paint them differently. We're, we're creating and designing new curtains that will be hung in those spaces. And we're lighting them. And vaudeville, in a way, has become for us um, the production concept in that, um, like everything else is changing, the economy, the moral values in America, and the population in terms of its divergent peoples, so is theater. Theater's changing. And we're moving from vaudeville to the film era. We're really risking a lot. We're experimenting, we're changing our mind as we go, but, we, but we're very excited. I mean, I'm just like thrilled and proud. My name is Ryan Angelotti. I'm playing Mother in Near West Theater's production of Ragtime. It's a very special character to me because it's uh, basically because, I mean, her name is Mother and all I've ever wanted really in my life is to be a mother. This show has an amazing score and amazing music, amazing solo work, and amazing ensemble work, and the actors are so talented singing it and, you know, acting, performing while singing. There will be a thousand other wonderful things that happen, but I would go see this show if it was somewhere just for the music. The first thing that drew me to Ragtime was the incredible sweeping score by Lynn Ahrens and Stephen Flaherty. I love the music of this story. I'm Jeffrey Short and I'm playing Cole House Walker Jr. in the Near West Theatre production of Ragtime. 
it's such a passionate story of people trying to change or searching for change. Um, you have the established sort of wasp population uh, of America who doesn't want things to change. You have the Eastern European immigrants who have struggled to get here and have struggled through Ellis Island who are trying to change their lives for the better. And you have the African American population based in Harlem who are also trying to change their lot. It's a passionate story of people trying to find their way, clawing and scratching their way either to something or away from something. It is a story of race and class and difference and primarily about the conflicts among those that are part of the American experience. I'm Hans Holtznagel. I play Tate in this production of Ragtime at Near West Theatre. It's about people crossing boundaries in risky ways, but the heart of it is the differences and the difficulties we have in America in crossing those lines of difference. And some of it's due to privilege and the way things are set up, and some of it's due to a kind of bigotry and an unwillingness to cross. And this play gives us both. It gives people struggling with those lines. Some of them cross them in really bold ways. Others of them are stuck on one side of it and can't see beyond it. And it's really rich, this story, precisely because of that, because it steps up to those lines and gives us what happens when we step up to those lines. Go out and tell our story. Let it echo far and wide. Make them hear you. Make this is my first show I've done here, um, and I really like it. Like, I, I enjoy coming to rehearsals. Working with everyone just gives me so much energy because everyone up on stage is giving 100% every single time that they're on stage. It has been a thrill working with Bob and Stephanie and everyone at Near West and especially this cast and the amazing genius and creative artistry of the crew um, is just something you can't find anywhere else and I think audiences are really going to be thrilled by this production of Ragtime. This group of actors uh, is ready to go there. They've been supportive of each other from the start. They're willing to take risks. Nobody's holding back. And uh, if you turn to somebody on stage, uh, there's going to be somebody there for you with a reaction. Uh, the, the, the barriers to that are fewer than one sometimes experiences on stage. So I think that's going to be where some of the excitement is for the audience as well. We are, I'm, I'm convinced we're going to offer a production which for ragtime lovers, will be a breath of fresh air. It'll be a new way to see the show. <laughs>